What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the City of Z. Once again, I will be your tour guide today and I hope you enjoy your stay. And today we actually got a little other trailer for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And uh, the one thing that I wanted to talk about, you can look up the trailer yourselves. Uh, you get to see the Atlas Gorge map. It looks pretty cool. There's like the rail gun. You can operate the rail gun. It's pretty awesome. But the real thing that I want to be talking about in this video is Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and its DLCs and how the DLCs are going to work to be exact so so I'm just gonna give you guys the info and then my opinion so we have four DLC map packs Havoc, Ascendance, Supremacy, and Reckoning those are the four DLCs and if you get to see it uh, if you get by the season pass for fifty dollars hey you get all of them and you get instant access to Atlas Gorge so some of you might want to do that now, here's the thing. Here's the thing that really, really troubles me. Oh, and Havoc is going to be released in January, by the way. So just some information for you guys there. But um, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Who would want to buy the Season Pass if you don't get some other little game mode map or edition? If you don't know, if that, that didn't really make any sense to me as I just said that. But what I mean is... I really could care less for four new multiplayer maps. Multiplayer maps, in my opinion, are fun because it's multiplayer. It's not necessarily the map. There are going to be good maps and there are going to be bad maps. I never play DLC multiplayer maps unless it's a remade old version. I, I don't do that. I don't see the point. They, I mean, some of them could be fun, but I would not pay $15 per map or $50 for four sets of four multiplayer maps. I wouldn't pay it. That's a that makes no sense in my mind. Unless there is something else, unless they are going to have some sort of co-op mode where they're going to have some new map for, then that would be the only reason I'd get it. The only reason I bought DLC, Zombies. The only reason I bought one DLC in Call of Duty actually it's two. Two DLCs in Call of Duty Ghosts was Extinction. That's the only reason for it. There was no reason for me to buy a multiplayer uh, map. I didn't I didn't see that. And that's just my personal opinion. I don't know what your guys' thoughts are. If you want to leave the, your comments down below about that, that would be fantastic. Because I'd like to know. I'd like to know whether you're, you're planning on buying the season pass or not. I'm not going to get it unless we have some sort of other game mode where it's actually worth it. Where you get a new big map and a big thing to explore as opposed to just yet another multiplayer map. Now, in these... In these uh, map packs, you do get two weapon DLCs. Hey, hey, two weapons instead of one weapon, and and one that means one gun's replacing a co-op mode. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. I I'm I don't know. I don't know. I just don't. I don't see the logic behind getting a uh, the season pass. That's just my personal opinion. Uh, I just wanted to convey that. I'm really hyped for Advanced Warfare. I think it's going to be a great game. Just hoping they give us something more than uh, what we now what we know of now. So leave your thoughts down below, guys. I'd love to hear them. And make sure to subscribe so you don't miss exclusive Advanced Warfare content starting whenever the ban is li lifted. I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Peace.